Ahoy my hatchlings, and welcome to another episode of AutoCraft. And I am having a really hard time controlling my boat from this angle, but we are going to start this episode off by meeting up with Rusty, and going ahead and doing what we need to do to go ahead and break bedrock. So we should be here now. Here is Rusty's cute little home. It has a nice windmill and such, and some farms, and um, where's Rusty? Oh, there's Rusty. I, 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 I ran right by him. Hello, Rusty. Hey, hello. Hello. Hello, hello. hello. So, Good to see you're here. Yes, yes. It's a lovely savannah you're in. Yeah, the, the grass colors are awful, but it's uh, it's nice and warm. Yeah, you know, the grass it's... colors are terrible. The leaf colors are awful. It's really dry here. Like, ugh. Why, why do you yeah, live here? Because the dirt was pristine. You know, that's fair, and this is probably one of the nicest dirt houses I've ever seen. Thank you, that was what I was aiming for. I will say, though, that this, this entrance is a little short. I feel like I'm banging my head here. Yeah, I, I'm I'm short person, I just... I, yeah. It's not great, but I feel like doors are just too high techy techy, you know? I suppose that's fair. So, we want to go ahead and break bedrock, but yes, I, I think there's quite a bit of stuff we need to get first. Uh, like mm -hmm. we need the obsidians and the pistons. I have a little bit of gunpowder, but we're going to need a lot more and we're going to need some TNT. So I'm thinking I'm going to go through and search for through a bunch of shipwrecks and temples yeah. and stuff, try and find some TNT. And awesome. if you want to Sounds gather good. up some obsidian and the pistons and stuff, I think yeah, we I... should be fairly good to go here. Yeah, I already have a bunch of pistons in here we can use, um, so that that's going to be good. Obsidian, yeah. That uh, luckily I've I've already gotten myself an efficiency five pickaxe, so we should we should be good. We should be good. Very nice, very nice. Uh, by chance, do you have food? I heard you had saplings, or I, yeah, I, I heard you needed saplings. I, I have do, saplings, I but I only have a single steak. Ah. I now have no food. <laughs> well, luckily for you, I have like a very big cow farm, so. Uh, if, we, if you want, we could do like a little trade. Uh, yeah. You get a stack of steak, I get get some stuff in. Yeah, that sounds good. I have six with sounds me. Awesome. Yay. Great. Food. Glorious food. Away. Magical food. Wonderful food. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Uh, so I guess with that, let's go well, ahead and we will meet back up in a bit when I have some TNT and you have some obsidian. So Rusty, we've gone on a bit of a journey, and we now have quite a few resources. So yeah. I believe we're ready to try and get on top of the ender roof. Uh, yeah. Can you give um, us a quick rundown of the resources we have so far to do this? We have over a stack of obsidian, so plenty of plenty of uh, room for error there. We yeah. have twenty eighteen T, so we have about fourteen attempts. Uh, that's it's probably going to be enough. Yeah, it's not bad. Uh, uh, there's only uh, there's only one thing. Okay. Uh, we only have two ender pearls. Ooh, this is gonna is... be a little hard then. Yeah, this is go That's the bare minimum to get on top of the nether roof, and that's if we don't make a mistake. Well, don't screw it up then. So should we go through then? I am so oh. scared of the nether. Uh, I'm going to hold my shield in my hand. I never do this, but yeah, I've I've not been to the nether yet. Me neither. Okay, let's go. It's just gonna imagine it just puts us on a ledge and just kills us. Oh. Oh, okay. This, can... this isn't too bad. Oh. This should be quite nice. This is someone else's portal. Yes, it is. As a matter of fact, um, mm. stuff and things is right over there. Is he? Hello, let's get him. No, just yeah. kidding. <laughs> we should probably go back bridge. to where we should go back to the overworld see where this connects to uh and make sure that we actually put the portal in the right place uh or so we can put the, the th going up to the ground in the right place hopefully yeah, this can brings right. us back because this is it doesn't. this is it doesn't. pretty far away yeah no this didn't okay that's that's not brilliant um uh, okay, where, where am you? i all right, 
I I've built the portal. Okay, Rusty's built the portal, and hopefully he should come through any second now. Uh, I'm on my way. Yay! There he is. Yes, it's linked up. Woohoo! So if we awesome. go back through, okay. that's a good. No, good one song. of us should not go through in case it's messed up. Good point. Okay, uh, it's fine. It's fine though. It's in a ran random hole. Yeah, we're just in a random hole in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> okay. Well, that. Did you awesome. Go back through. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure it was still good. Okay. Well, awesome. We now have ourselves a linked portal. So I suppose now the next step is we need to get up to that nether roof and see if we can't find our way through. Yeah. Splash, are you ready? So here we see Rusty preparing to cross over the nether roof. I'm Let's watch carefully. To, I'm actually going to eat a steak. I'm not even going to eat a steak. I'm going to eat golden apple. <laughs> for, for you who don't know, I'm still at zero depth and I want to keep it that way. Yes, he's still at zero depth. He doesn't want to die yet. Oh, oh, well, that ruined it, didn't it? Yep. Oh, there's a... It. There's, there's a... There's another... A, an endermite. <laughs> okay, well... I, um, I guess... I guess we need to go... Go get a... Go get a... Oh, uh, gosh. Okay, that's gonna be... That, that would be the reason. <laughs> oh, there was a lag spike at the wrong time. <sighs> oh, that's awful. Okay, well, I guess we need to go... Uh, go turn a villager into uh, into a cleric. We should go ahead and get ourselves a blade r blaze rod while we're down here. Oh, this is going to be annoying. Tell me, friend, would you like to get in this boat? You would! What a wonderful decision. Let's go! Sir, let me take this chance to welcome you as a new recruit to the... Uh, Captains of Industry, Village, Religious Team. You will serve very important duties here, mostly providing us with, mostly providing us with, ow, mostly providing us with Ender Pearls. And should you fail to give us an Ender Pearl, well, you will simply be terminated. It is a wonderful opportunity, and you are such a lucky, lucky man. Uh, he's just the next volunteer, Rusty. It's okay. He's just really excited yeah. and can't wait for the opportunity for this new job. He is yeah. so excited. Just yeah. really I can, I can can't wait to that. get into it. Okay, he's leveled up. He sells underpearls! Rusty, the first guy is a genius! He's a genius! You know what that makes you? <laughs> Second best. <laughs> He, he slowly, he thought I was going to kill him. He slowly looked like. Okay, well. Well, uh, th this went easier than we expected. Yeah, but we still need quite a bit more wood. Heck of a lot better than last time when we tried doing this and... Uh, oh, yeah. And we had to go through three villagers before we got it. Okay. All right, first attempt didn't go too well. Not really, no. No, it didn't. Also, getting these under post to how long? Like, an hour? Half an hour? You know, a lot less than I expected. Actually, yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's get this started. Yep, go for it. Three, two, two one. one. Yeah, I'm... How big is this chance? <laughs> <laughs> what are these endermites? Okay, uh, as I was saying, I, I'm going to try it over here, because this is more enclosed. Okay. Also, I... Oh, I was, I was crashing. Okay. Go, Rusty. Go. Yes! Ah, yeah, we're over here. Woohoo! Oh, awesome. Okay, Ooh, well, okay. now we just need to make the portal up there and then come all the way back down and then come to the specific spot. So, what was it again? Uh, 60, 67, negative 11 is our, is our breaking spot. 67. Oh, not, uh, I didn't mean the breaking spot, I meant the, uh, the portal. Oh, I don't know. Hold on, let me write down the breaking spot. I'll be right back. Okay, so we are finally back at the nether portal. We had to go quite a ways. Rusty, are you ready in the over- er, on the nether roof? Uh, yes I am. Okay, so should I go then? Yes, you should. Three, two, one, let's go. 
Ooh, and yes. yes, yes, we're on the nether roof. Oh my goodness. Uh, this went so much better than last time. Now, uh, now we just have to break bedrock. But yeah. And but this is great. This is really awesome. We did great here. All right. Ooh, so you wrote down the coordinates, right? I did. Yes. Our coordinates are 67 and negative 11. So I suppose let's go ahead and quickly get our stuff set up. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what's what's funny? Is, is this it? It's, it's gonna blow out the nether <laughs> portal, isn't it? <laughs> well, good thing well, we. I have a flint still. I have a flint still. It'll be fine. It, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. We'll figure it out. Okay. Ready? Yes. Uh, flick the lever. Okay. Three, two, one. Oh, oh shh! I messed it up. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <gasps> no, I didn't. Wait, no. <laughs> we did it in the wrong spot. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. why? How, how did I screw that up? Uh, one block. The, 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 this is where you put the nether brick or nether rack. Yeah, you said. You said sixty-seven negative eleven, but it's sixty-seven negative twelve. No, on my on my little HUD it says sixty-seven negative eleven right here. You have to use the looking at block feature. You don't have to have the the HUD. <sighs> ah. Okay, so we're good. okay we're we just have to delete the whole world, start over. Yeah, no, we're, we'll just have a two wide hole. We'll do, <laughs> yeah, it'll be fine. <laughs> Uh, okay, this goes he Oh, right, I don't... You don't have most of the stuff. Um, and then we need the trapdoor goes here. Thank you. And here and here, right? Yep. Okay, so... Okay. Here, down. I have the piston in my hand. Okay, ready? Okay. Yep. Three, two, one... Okay, and that looked perfect. Are you sure? No, I'm not. Oh. I thought it was perfect. Yeah, well. That's disappointing. <laughs> Why didn't it work that time? <laughs> okay, let's try again. Uh, do you need to eat or whatever? No, I'm not. I haven't taken any damage yet. Okay. Well, three, two, one. Did it work? It's upside down again, so I highly doubt it. Yeah. You know, I'm wondering if it's breaking because we broke the bedrock here, but that doesn't make sense. Maybe, Why well, isn't it working now? In, how about just in case? I highly doubt it. Just in case, we're just going to put... Yeah. <laughs> it, it, can't, it can't hurt. Yeah. All right. Three, two, one... That sounded like a retracting piston. It that did. was a retracting we have piston. Made a hole. Okay, I guess we need to know. I guess we now know that these blocks need to be full, or else this doesn't work. But huzzah! Yeah. We have broken through bedrock. Twice. 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 We didn't need to the uh. first time. <laughs> we just we just suck a bit. We just suck a bit. It's fine. Uh. It's fine. Uh, okay, well... Still, fantastic. We have finally gotten through the nether roof. I suppose we should probably go ahead and while we're here, uh, try and set up our portals, if we can. I think that'd be a good idea. Uh, yeah, I, I have not remembered my coordinates. And neither have I. I figured I would go by... Or I'd let you stay up here. I'd go by find my coordinates. Could I have, like, half a stack of obsidian or however much? Okay, well, Rusty says the portal is linked up. So let's light this candle and let's cross. See how it goes. No! Oh no, Wh where am I? Oh. Where am I? So, take two of this. I have also gone ahead and put a little decoration on my nether portal. I am finally back after it pushed me about 2,000 blocks away. Rusty has relit the portal in the right spot because I accidentally forgot to tell him that it was at negative 222 and not positive but that is okay let's go through and hope this lines up or I'm going to be a very very sad lizard yes 
Rusty, look! Woo. Yay! Oh, we made it. Me. Hey, look, I can see your portal from here. Oh, Jeez, this is, is mine, isn't it? this 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 oh. is a this is a lot longer range than our other world. I hope. Hello, Alex. How are you? Uh, so, uh, you have a very nice bookshop. And this is very 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 fast. We've 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 only been on here for like like two days, but yes, sir. We're on it. Uh, so, I I don't really have diamonds right now. I shake my head there. So, oh, whoopsie. <laughs> so, I You've was... You've been busy, that's all. Sorry? You've been busy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, busy reading books and handling stuff and whatnot. Uh, right. Oh, that is a lot brighter. Ah, there you go. Yeah. Nice and warm now. <laughs> uh, right there. So, I was wondering if we could come to some sort of arrangement where I could buy books from you and pay you later, or... Do something where I give you a bunch of IOUs. I even have an mm. anvil with me that I could give you something like an IOU per six diamonds. Ooh, that kind of feels a little bit worth it. What do you need? What kind of books are you looking for? Just two? Uh, I, probably a couple. Uh, I'd probably want to... Do you have... Let's see, you have Silk Touch, Efficiency, Unbreaking, Mending. I'd, oh, yeah. I'd probably want to get my, my picks up, so... Probably like six to eight books, I'm thinking, maybe? Maybe right, more? so how about you take what you need, Okay. and then it'll just basically be an IOU, because you're pretty good at redstone, huh? I am good at redstone. Okay, so we might, I might need some help with that in the future. Okay. It'll be nice to be able to call on you. Nothing crazy, obviously, but, you know, reasonable. Yeah. Okay, well, awesome. I wanted a... Oh, shoot, I... My... <laughs> you know, this, this fire will be very useful. I have a lot of, of stuff? I have a lot of crap in my inventory. Oh man, oh, my inventory management is really bad right now. So that'd be five IOUs. Perfect. Or, or you just want it as one big IOU. Also, where did my anvil go? I, I took the anvil. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So five IOUs. I think that's fair. Um, and it may be you know smaller things that we need to do later, but. We'll figure it out as we go. No yeah. Deal. So we went ahead and got those books from Alex. And I went ahead and I started searching to see if I could find a cave spider spawner, among other things. And as I searched through my mesa, I accidentally came across this zombie spawner. Which means we do actually have a nice little, nice little farm here. Now, I thought I was completely safe, because zombies aren't supposed to be able to cross... They're not supposed to be able to cross these things. But I think we can make this basically completely safe if we put some trapdoors here or something. Maybe some iron trapdoors. Oh, we got another guy on this side. These zombie reinforcements are a bit of a pain. But, yeah. So, we're actually mending our stuff up really nice and quickly here. I might need to get a new sword, though. So... We've gone ahead and lit up this farm a bit, so that way mobs aren't spawning in here, and I'm thinking we should turn this into a proper farm, a real farm, and not and not just relying on these rails here. And that'll be a good source of XP for us, since we don't really have one right now, and I could search through all these things and try and find cave spider spawners, but so far I haven't really had much luck. I was hoping I'd be able to find a bunch of cave spider spawners really nice and close together, and we could make a really nice and powerful cave spider spawn. But, you know, I think these zombie spawners are probably going to be okay. And unlike the cave spiders, the zombies aren't going to constantly be poisoning me. So let's go ahead. We'll clear out this area, make out of another portal here. And then we'll have our own little XP farm so we can actually enchant things like we want to. So with that, let's jump into the first hyper speed ah, Let's jump into the first hyper speed build mode of this season. I'm really excited. Yay! Quick talking over a black screen here. Uh, Hyper Street build mode didn't work, so there's not one. Sorry. Okay, I've written down the coordinates, figured out where I need to place the new thing, so I should be good here. I have my obsidian, my flint and steel, as well as something to cover my portal within the uh, nether world. So hopefully, 
let's make this work. And perfect, I came out right where I expected to, and oh dear, there's a zombie on the roof. Why is there a zombie on the roof? Shoo! Okay, let's go ahead over to our coordinates, which is 111, which is, well, it's right here. And then negative 283, so that's going to be this way a little bit. You know, this is a surprising bit of way, honestly. Let's go one, two, do, do, one, two, three, one, two, three. And, of course, because we are not degenerates, we put full corners. As well as, let's just put something on top here so our portal doesn't get diorated. Light it, and hopefully this should take us over to our zombie spawner. And it has! Excellent! That means this thing is- oh dear, this is a really small area to try and do this in. That means this area is now actually fully set up. So that's awesome! I don't think we actually have much less, much left to do this episode. I think we're really running out of time, so I think we're probably going to go ahead and call it here, unless something else comes up. But with that, I've been Splashes, thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye!